Hey there everybody, Red Bearsight here, and welcome back to Let's Play Banjo-Kazooie Blind. In the last episode, eh, we made some progress, but not all that much. All things considered, we explored that crane. And we also went down into the hole of the ship and dealt with some boxes, which were not fun. And so, first things first, I want to check what my totals are looking like. 59? notes, four jiggies, and one honeycomb piece. I've already spent an hour here, at least according to the game, which I'm not all that happy about. Uh, all right, well, we have, see, we have, there's like, there's a Jinjo here, and I think like a Mumbo's token and whatnot, but otherwise, uh, can't really see anything else that they really do with this area. The only real thing that stands out to me is this canister right here is gold, and the other ones are not. Which I have no idea what to do with it, uh, but you know, it's, it's kind of different. Which means there might be like something important, like I don't know, maybe a Jiggy hiding inside that I just have no idea how to get to. I still have no idea why this one is here, actually. I think I've tried pretty much everything I can. Except for maybe TNT boxes, but I don't have those on hand. So I think I'm, again, at a loss. If that means anything, then I have no idea what it actually is supposed to do. So I, I'm pretty sure I can't break these. Yeah, that's, that's what I thought. So is there another way to get inside any of these? I know I've been inside a few of them already. Uh, like that one right there. Oh, I fell in the water. That's bad for my health in more ways than one. As long as we get away from the shark, though, we'll be mostly okay. Yeah, so we went inside that one. But I think there are two others that we haven't been able to get inside yet. So there's the one that I was just on, and then I think there's, yeah, there's one more over this way, which actually, no, I think there was, wasn't there uh, one of the windows we broke? Or maybe that was a different, a different one. I can always just check, it's right over here. No, as soon as the camera would feel like cooperating. And, okay, so yeah, that window. Camera, please! Okay, yeah, we we have not been inside this particular one, I don't think. So it leaves me curious, is, is there a way to get inside all of them, or are some of them just kind of decoration? That I don't really know. Alright, well, let's try exploring the ship a little bit more, because I think there's still more to it that we have not yet found out. I still, I still need, I need to figure out some way of uh, getting down, no, I think it was this, this guy over here that was the evil ventilation shaft from that one place that we don't talk about. And yes, I mean it's Twilight, the book. We don't talk about that place. Okay. Uh, I'm trying to think of what I can do to this guy. Because that obviously was not effective. And neither was that. Like, any any attempt I have of trying to uh, approach this guy just gets just utterly destroyed. Like, even that one, approaching him from above. Hey, guy, go away. Jeez. Okay, that's a code. 312111. Yeah. 31 is number two. It's not like 23 is number one, but, you know, it's close enough. I have no idea how to deal with those guys, and I know they lead to stuff. I am absolutely certain of it. But, just, just what do I do to them? Because I there, there aren't any powers that I don't already have that I could get. So... There has to be something. I just can't seem to figure it out. Which just, it, it sucks for me, just because I, I want to figure it out and, oh, 
Okay, well, that code suddenly makes a lot more sense. So at least we figured that out. So there's 312 and then just three ones. So, uh, does this do something awesome for us? Hooray! So that's, that's one more. So at least that, that's a positive note. Okay, we can, we can go yet higher on this thing. Because I know that I saw smokestacks. Which we can climb up, yeah. So here are the smokestacks. Maybe we can get inside the ship this way? Through one of one of the smokestacks? I mean, I wouldn't be surprised after all. We've gone into the ship through stranger places. So, yeah, there's a ladder. Okay. We can climb up, and this will go through. Okay. Now there's a lot... Ooh! I do not like that guy. I need to get my revenge. Uh, post haste. Fortunately, that knocked me down quite a bit. And I was lucky that I didn't actually get uh, knocked down farther and then I actually got hurt from it. So that's a positive outlook on it, I suppose you could say. It could have been worse. We still need to get back up, though, so... Let's do so. This time we're going to be more careful. It's, uh, this. And we'll exact our revenge. Okay, so there's a jump pad there, which I'm assuming will get me inside. I want to get these notes first, though. And see what else there is on the top of this smokestack over here. Now there's another ladder. Okay, well, I guess I'm going to try this ladder first. Oh! <laughs> okay! Uh, there's just a Jiggy sitting on top of the smokestack. Because why not? Why? What? I don't even know. So, uh, we got more Jiggies. Let's see if we... I'm, I'm hoping the other smokestack will lead us inside. So let's see... Uh, no, dang it. it, it doesn't. It's just a mumbo token. So is that uh, the extent that's on the top of the ship? I'm sad, because I was hoping that there'd be a little bit more from exploring this area. It doesn't appear that way, though. Uh, da -da -da. What else can the ship offer us? I know there's one down inside the hull of the ship. Somewhere. Uh, because I've seen it before, I just can't, I have no idea how to actually get to that particular area yet. So there's that one, and then there's also the one that's uh, in the rudders, which I need to figure out how to get that one as well. Oh, I don't want to go down this thing. Apparently I'm going down this thing whether I want to or not. This area has not, not really changed at all. Good to know! So we have, we have those two that I, I know where they are, but I don't know how to get them yet. And then, I guess there, there are two more that I, I don't know. Uh, I haven't seen them yet, at least as to my knowledge, I don't know where they are. Uh, the other thing I have to take into account is that I have 73 notes so far, which means I'm missing over a quarter of them. Which, uh, I need to remedy that. There's gotta be something to do about these guys. That... I, I tagged him from behind! What what way is going to work better than that? I really don't know. Uh, is there really nothing I can do? Is that just... It seems... It seems like I should be able to do something. But all my attacks just, just don't work. And then I just get hurt for it. Which kind of sucks. See, I'm inclined to believe... Oh, I need to hit the switch again, don't I? Or no, I don't. I've already hit it. They just... They just move slower and faster. Yeah, look at look how many notes there are in here. And then there's the... Uh, yeah, I think the Jiggy's on that platform. Yep. I can't see it normally, but when I... When I look in first person, I can see it. 
see. Well, I, don't, I can't see any. Okay. Oh, wait. There's a switch. That looks like the propeller blade outside. So, if I can find my way in here, I can get both of them. I need to find my way in there, though. Good. See, I, I'm, I'm led to believe that this, this, uh, this entrance right here was from one of those ventilation shafts, that the other one would be from the other guy, but... You know, I just haven't figured that out yet, apparently. Okay. I, I really don't see any other ways in. Unless there's just some giant gaping hole in the ship that I'm, I'm missing, but I highly doubt it. Alright, um... Well, I think I just need some time to look, go around and try to search for things. I've already been over most of the world at this point, so... I hope you guys won't get mad at me for uh, cutting out some of my just derping around and trying to find stuff, but it's it, it just needs to be done. So I will meet you when I find stuff. Okay, well, uh, that's something that I probably saw at some point before, but didn't come back to for whatever reason. Okay, give me, give me that, please. I would very much like that. So, what is, what exactly is this? We're inside the smokestack now. It would appear. Uh, we have a dangerous hive, and this. Uh, okay, well that answers two of my questions, and there's a third question there that I have now. Uh, let's see, can I see it from this side? Yes, I can. Uh, I need something, though. All right, I'm gonna play it safe. I'm gonna get to this side first, and then we'll we'll try this now, and then we'll just we'll just double back. See, see how great that was. It was just fantastic. This is kind of scary. No! You didn't just do that. No, you didn't. You lie. Jeez. Those guys were kind of annoying before, but now I kind of have different opinions of them. Uh, they're among my list of new, not favorite things in the game. Freaking gosh, that is really annoying. Cause I think every other place that we've encountered them, geez, uh, there has been some place where we can get a higher uh, like vantage point than them, so we could do that. Freaking gosh, and now they're just so hard to hit. Well, this this one this one guy. Let me rephrase that. There! Jeez. can have your friggin', I don't know, oatmeal and eat it too. You don't get cake. Let's wait for this to slow down because that's gonna happen. What do, what do people without save states do here? I mean, like, this would drive me out of my mind. Oh, it stops. Okay, well, uh, that's good to know. Now I just have to wait for this to happen again. Okay, you're stopping again. Oh! And that is instant death. Wow. I'm, see, th this, is what, this is one of the things that, uh, to me, ruins how amazing of a game this is because this, this is a really good game like I, I really I like this game I really want to like it uh, but it's just there there's some stuff that it does like making you lose all your progress if you die in a level that just, just turns me off like 
from wanting to... Uh, is this really a thing? Apparently it is. And I just, I just did that. Okay. I'm just gonna roll with it. Alright, I'm assuming this is gonna be the thing outside, yeah. We're gonna stop, and everything's gonna be all hunky-dory with the world. Okay. okay. Can we actually do anything to this glass, or is it actually just normal glass? I think it's just normal glass. It's not special. Alright, so now we have to deal with, uh, these fans. Which I managed to do somehow. I'll take it. Wait, there's another... Why is there another one? Because I thought that switch just turned both of them off. Alright, let's get the jiggy while we're, while we're over here in this neck of the woods. Collect that one, which is number seven. And we're going to have to wait for the cycle again, I think. Jeez, the, the camera angle is kind of really awkward for this. Ow. Great. We're doing this again. We're doing it again. This is not... Even, for, even when it's slow, it's kind of tough to avoid. Like, I don't, I don't know how I did it that first time without that effort, but I somehow I did. Like, I, I'm really sorry that I'm using so many save states, but, like, at this point, when I have 81 notes, I don't want to have to go and recollect all that stuff again. It's just, it's not worth it to me, and I, I missed my opportunity for this moment. I just have to wait again, and... Slow down. There. Uh, nothing over that axle. Okay, good. Yeah, what does this do? Is there... Oh, I have to hit both of the switches, apparently, to actually fully stop them. Okay, well, I guess that... I guess that works. Oh, wait. What? You're kidding me. I have to leave and do... do this in that amount of time? That is mental, and I probably should have gotten on doing that sooner. I don't know if I'm going to make it now. So the timers in this game have been really super, super strict with uh, what they allow you to do. This one's a, a bit longer, which is nice, uh, but still a problem. Okay, we have 20 seconds to make it there. I don't know if I'm going to make this. This is looking unlikely. Ow. I did not. That killed me. Thank you for that game love you. Really, really, really love you for that. Okay, come on. Alright, uh, I'm gonna make a save right before I hit the switch. And we should time this with, uh, the next movement. So that we can get a good run of this. So... Our way across. I would collect that token on any other day except this one. Like if were, if I were not in this exact circumstance, then I would totally do do it. That was stupid. It was really stupid of me. Uh, either that or what I can do is I can I can get the stuff so I don't have to bother collecting it uh, when I'm actually trying to get back. Probably the best idea. Okay, uh, that could have been worse. Just wait for this to go back. Yeah, let's make let's make this time the last time that I have to do this. All right, we get to watch this whole thing again. Uh, that was not the best execution of that that I could have had. 
Okay, that just went, so we're completely safe to go across this now, full speed. Unfortunately, we're not going to be able to cut our way directly through that area because of the bees. We just have to go around. Right. Uh, this is looking slightly more promising than my last attempt. I wonder if I could somehow shortcut across that. It would be kind of awkward, though, considering the camera angle. So now we have ten more seconds to do this. Well, assuming these actually are seconds, which I think they are. This game actually has a decent time, but they're not like Mario seconds, which are like 2.2 seconds per second, which is just a ratio. Okay, yeah. Uh, we don't have time to lose. There. Oh man, you just yeah, you, you actually have to get out, in and out there of there in that time. I, jeez. Uh, okay. Well, I think we did everything that we could in that uh, that area down there. Which let's see where that leaves us. Eighty-five. 85 notes, 8 jiggies, and 1 honeycomb piece. I'm close. Uh, a lot closer than the last, last episode, actually. We got quite a bit done. But we're still, there's still, there's got to be some place that I have not found yet. At least that's just the way that it, it seems to me. Because they're... There are, what, 15 notes that I don't have yet, so they have to be somewhere. And they're, you know, odds are they're probably somewhere together, if I had to take a guess. But I just have to find where that is. Which is an increasing problem uh, with levels I've noticed, is that I just have trouble finding places. And maybe that was a problem from the very beginning, but... Yeah, there's just, there's just some place that I haven't haven't found yet that you know there's just stuff and I just haven't got it. So. Uh, I will figure all that out next time though. We've done plenty enough for one episode, so thank you for watching this episode of Let's Play Banjo Kazooie Blind. I'm Red X Parasite, signing out.